Speaking of the Worldwide Gold Giveaway, we might as well count it out right now and see what everyone has left in it. Oh, yeah. Oh, there's those monstrous lead shot. Oh, look at the chunks. I've really got to get my hands on these pay dirt. That's really cool, isn't it? It's good to see it being like, it's quite a lot. It's, yeah, yeah, I think it's oh, How am I going to do it? Losing that crush sample. Woohoo! I know. <laughs> Siri, dial Andrew, two brothers prospecting. Oh, we're getting a phone call. Yes, sir. Hello, two brothers. G'day, Andrew. Gadsy here, Buckshot Prospector. Respect the community, always stay humble. Yeah. Gadsy! I heard you've got some pretty rich pay dirt you want to palm off. Oh, yeah, that's awesome. Yeah, I'd be pretty interested in getting my hands on that. Yeah. All right, meet me around the corner in five minutes. Come by yourself, because I'm pretty shy. Thanks, see you then. Ha-ha. I'll be back here. I'll see you again. See you on the front door. Prospect, come on. Woo! Come on, Valley. Let's go find him. There he is. Hit a driver. Yeah. There he is. to get my pay dirt. Who are you? Oh. Oh. Okay. Sorry, I just got dirt. Yeah. Well, good day, everyone. Now that I've got this pay dirt, it's time for me to find some gold to put in it. Now, I usually go detecting. I haven't been panning for a long time. Usually, a bit of hard rock, crushing specimens is my thing. I'm not bad in the old specimen gold, so I do have a fair bit of that to crush. I thought I was gonna do that, but the last two YouTubers have already crushed some rocks to put in the pay dirt. So I thought I might take my pan down to the creek, find some gold, chuck it in the bag. Sounds like fun. I'll grab some gear. Let's go. Woo. All right, people, we're down at the creek. I've got my little sluice set up down there and I'll give you a quick look at what I'm working with today. It's a creek. All of this stuff here looks very juicy to me. With the grass growing out of it. Just after the bedrock there. Might clear some of these big rocks. And have a bit of a dig there. Then once I've found a little bit, I'll fill up a couple buckets and we'll chuck them down the sluice. Ripper. excited when I heard about this dirt. I thought, what a brilliant idea, eh? So, so proud, so happy that I actually whizzled my way into it. Give it a good stir. Let's see how we go. A lot of ironstone in it. Very heavy. A little bit of black sand. To be honest, I'm probably just still digging into uh, someone else's high banking tailings, but we'll see if we can't get onto it a bit. Hopefully we get a big nugget. Oh, we've got plenty of little bits of gold. All right. This is interesting. 
There you go. It's not too bad. Literally from that hole to there, it's got a bit of a rock in it. The sluice is up there, so... Well, if that's sitting on top there, it's only very little stuff. But if that's sitting on top, I might just keep on digging through here. Woohoo! Success on the first pan. That never happens, but I'll take it. Let's fill up some buckets, get them down that sluice. Yeah. Now, I do know how to find gold on a creek and in the gold fields. If you ever want to come out with me, just message me. I'm going out as much as I possibly can these days, and I will try and teach you how to find the gold as well. Awesome. Oh, that's gold. Woohoo. So I've got one bucket full up there. About to go run it down the sluice. What I'm gonna do is, before I do that, and before this fills in with all the other stuff, I'm gonna do another test pan, straight out of the bottom there. Just to see whether or not it's worth keep digging here after I run that bucket. juicy looking material so here we go let's see if there's a nuggy in here waiting for us or someone whoever the lucky bugger is who wins this dirt woohoo as I was saying ripper I watched a video last night of Andrew from another gold prospector. Checked his classifier, found a beautiful nugget. But we can't spend all day looking through the classifier, can we? Oh, that's gold. Oh, we got some gold. There we go. So we're still on the gold, that's for sure. Whatever that is. Yeah, still on the gold. Nice little bits. All right, I'm gonna run that bucket that's sitting up there down the sluice. And then I'm gonna come and fill up a couple more out of that spot because she's pretty good. And those who have been watching my channel for a while know I always love to pan the very bottom of the bucket out. It's always the best pan you get for the day. Anyway, I'll go and do that now. The sluice is running sweet. And there's plenty of visible gold in it already. Let's get a little zoom in. You can see a few bits just here. A couple bits there. Oh, it's all over it. We won it because that was some pretty neat looking test stands. Ripper! I've just started panning off the bottom of the bucket. Look at that. Ho ho ho! Someone's in for some gold. Oh no, it's not much, but it is, it, it's ridiculous. I don't know what to say. Look how much little bits of gold are in that bottom of the bucket pan. All right, let's get it done. Sick. Now I firmly believe if you can't have a pay dirt bucket that runs through Victoria and not do a day at Slady Creek. 
What a six spots, Lady Creek. There's got to be, what, 50 to 100 bits in there? Um, yeah, some good gold coming out of here. So a lot of bedrock shelf running across here. And the sluices up there. Right, run another bucket time. Woo! Hey guys, if you haven't already, after this video, go and check out the other legends who've been part of this pay dirt. They're awesome. I'll leave a link in the description so you can easily go and find them. But make sure you wait to the end of the video. You've got to find out who's coming up next. Well, I've just finished filling up another bucket from down there. I've just gone over a little bit further towards that side. Uh, it's nice clay. I'll give you a quick look at this stuff. Now, anyone who doesn't get excited about that on a creek, that is just jam-packed full of gravels and sticky as. So, there's gold in that. I know there is, because I've been test panning. And I'll show you one of the test pans I've just done. Look, it's not massive, but for someone who doesn't pan all the time, brown finger, <laughs> them some nice bits. You know, they've got some size to them. That's a nice bit there. You can feel it. Anyway, not too shabby. Been a great little sad day so far. I'm going to finish classifying down this over here. Run it up the sluice over there. And then I reckon I might do a few more pans because I'm quite enjoying being down at the creek today. Why wouldn't you? Have a look at it. Sick. I'll take that. That. Alright, I'll get back to you when I'm finished running this bucket. Then we're going to go down there. Do a couple more test pans. A couple more pans. They don't have to be tests. I know there's gold there. Anyway, I'm going to head down there. Finish off the Arvo with uh, a few more pans. Uh, they're pretty good. They're pretty exciting little pans. So, pretty excited to get back down there. And I'm also very excited to see uh, after three buckets what we get in this sluice. You can see a few bits already. Pretty happy. Someone else is going to be pretty happy too when they get this pay dirt. Oh. And here we go. Look at that. There is gold all over it. Have a look at the ironstone. It's pretty nuts, isn't it? Black sand. But then you come up to these first couple cells that seem to catch it all. And there is gold all over the shop. Yeah! Woohoo! Alright, clean up time. This is pretty impressive, guys. Dream that mini sail. Woo! It cleans out good. Oh, so nice to get back down on the creek. All right, you want to keep your socks on. You want to keep your cotton socks on because wait till you see who the dirt's going to next. I'm not going to give you any clues, but just keep your cotton socks on because. You'll find out soon. Alright, 
So we're going to start off with a mighty pan of ironstone. Let's see how this pans out. I'm not going to take it back too far because I don't want to lose whoever's gold this is. But there's a heap in here anyway. I can see it already coming up through the top. There's a few nice little nuggies in there. When I say nuggies, I mean a little bit bigger than 40 jeepers creepers. Ugh. I mean, a little bit bigger than fly poop. It's like a high banker run. <laughs> uh, get some zoom in. All right. So it's all through this crap. That is super impressive. My goodness gracious me. Well, all I can say is a massive congratulations to whoever wins this pay dirt or this mineral sample. Um, it's my absolute pleasure to come down to the creek here and just thoroughly enjoy myself for the afternoon. Um, find a fair bit of gold. I'm pretty happy with the amount that I found. I don't know if it's going to weigh a lot because it's very little. Um, but look, I'll clean it up when I get home. We'll soon find out. It's not going to double the amount, but it looks pretty good to me. It's been a while since I've been on the creek. Um, yeah, anyway, I will dump this in the bucket and we'll have a good clean up at home whilst I pan out the mineral sample pay dirt. Woo! All right, you gold. Get in the bucket. I think I've got it all. <clears throat> I haven't had one skunk pan yet today. I don't reckon it's gonna happen now either. You know what? It's not a skunk, but it's pretty damn close. There's a couple of bits there. That's uh, pretty much that hole done. Done a bit of work over there. Not a bad little pile of rocks. Move some dirt, another little hole there. Creek's a bit dirty now. Anyway, congratulations to the winner. You get those three bits and I'm keeping the rest. <laughs> Signing off from the creek. It's been wonderful. I'm gonna have to do this more often, I think. So, uh, I quite like it down here. It's my, it's my spot. It's where I feel amazingly rested and peaceful. I'm not thinking about work. I, I love it. Get down the creek, do some panning. It's amazing. It's not hard to just chuck your rocks back in the hole. Come on, let's keep this place beautiful. All right, we've got a few pans set up, a bit of a panning station and the gold. Let's get the gold out of that pay dirt. Hey mate, give us some mercury. Here you go, mate. Here's some mercury. Right, let's open this up and see what's inside. All right, there's some pretty juicy looking stuff in here. You can see some quite nice nuggies there and a whole lot of other cool stuff. Let's get to it. Yeah. Right, I'm gonna pan off this big stuff. Then I'll move on to the smaller stuff. Just clean dirt. All right, if you want to be in a winning for this amazing pay dirt, all you got to do is go and see Andrew's page from That's Gold. Visit the original video where this all started and you too could be in the running to win this amazing pay dirt. It'll be awesome. Congratulations to whoever wins and good luck. It's the oversize. All right. Yeah. 
And is that jazzy? Oh yeah. I didn't even notice all that black sand can couple with that gold. Yeah, it hides it well, doesn't it? Yes. There's a whole heap more in there. Check that out. Not too bad. All right, there's a whole heap more good stuff in there. What I'll do is I'll suck that up. We'll get it on the scales. See how I went for panning. Then we'll get into this good stuff. The stuff I found at the creek. Yoo-hoo! Got some nice nuggets in there. Look at that pile of gold. It looked like much more down on the creek. <laughs> anyway, oh, that's pretty nice. Okay, so now it's time to see how I went panning. I think the total I'm chasing is 3.26 grams. Let's see how I went. Three point three six. I found more gold. Ripper. And now time for the gold that I found on the creek. I wonder how much there is. It always looks like there's way more on the creek, but I'm hoping for at least half a gram. Ooh. Point nine six. Just under a gram. All right. Let's add the two together, and we'll see how much is can win. One thing's for sure, with all the other goodies in the bag, all of this gold, it makes for a pretty amazing prize. So get in the draw. How do we go? 4.27. What an amazing pile of gold. Okay, so I must be feeling generous. In addition to the gold, I'm also thrown in this beautiful 1.35 carat pink sapphire I found in Emerald on a trip to Queensland as well as this beautiful little gold specimen found at Staffordshire Reef in Victoria. Well, good luck to all of those who get in the draw. Have a look at all the cool stuff you can win. Amazing. Remember, get to Andrew from That's Gold's channel. Go back to the original video where it all started. Leave a comment and you too will be in the draw to win this amazing prize. All right, so it's time to announce who the pay dirt goes to next. Here's a little channel, a little less known than myself, but give him a shot. He's good to the community and he always stays humble. That's right, it's Gazzy, the Buckshot Prospector. I can't wait to see what he does with the dirt. I'm sure it'll be a blast. Stay tuned and watch his video because it'll be amazing.